Welcome to the K1 World Grand Prix 2022. This is Japan K1 Featherweight World Tournament at the Fukuoka Kokusai Center. I'm Russell Goodall. And I'm Nicholas Pettis. So this is the second fight and the quarterfinals. Taito Gunji versus Faku Suarez from Argentina. So Gunji obviously holds the current uh, there. You see in the photo there the belt. He's the champ. He's, he is he the is actual champ of the Featherweight World Division. Or should we say the belt holder? And he, that is his champion belt. So, and I guess for him, he, he got, wants to prove himself again. He is the champion, whatever you say. What I think we're seeing here is, and let's be honest, yes, let's be honest. finally we're able to see the foreign fighters, the non-Japanese fighters coming in from all over the world Boom. and yes. challenging, you know, against this. So it's like a World Cup. It is, it is good, yeah. Without so, the belt being on with, the title. Exactly, yeah. So that's they, fine. they get a trophy, oh, yeah. that's a great combination, yeah. Larry. Nice. Suarez. So, Suarez is from Argentina. He didn't make it two years ago because of his flights. They cancelled the flights from Argentina with COVID. Oh, now, oh, oh, here he is. Loving his low kicks, by the way. First time in Japan Ooh. and first time in K1. Let's see what he can do. Oh! oh what? Okay. Nice. Okay. Watch out, Gunji. This is it. I mean, we're talking world level. Oh, oh, look at that comeback. Oh, 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 oh. oh okay. man, that just pissed off Gundy, right? It really, <laughs> he didn't like that. Yeah. As a champ, he's going to come right back at that. Oh, man. What? We're not even a minute into the first round? Because he needs to defend that belt. Yeah, but, yeah, he's not going to let go of the camera. This is why the World Cup is so exciting. Mm, mm. It's good to have that mix up just from all over, yeah. Let's hope things open up even more this year and beyond. Nice. It really has been a long drought yes. on the World Cup kind of season, kind of tournaments and stuff like that. It's really beautiful to see, you know, a mixed fight like this. Yeah. It's definitely uh, been a different long styles, time coming. Yeah. Different thinking, different everything. You know, mixing everything up like this is beautiful. Man, Suarez, I, I'm not. It's uh, yeah, I, I liked what he did very early on in, in round one. <laughs> you know, he almost had him. He like he almost had him there. Yeah, something. And he knows it too. Yeah, and he took took Gunji oh, off. Yeah. yeah. Ooh. I gotta say though, Gunji is a fantastic champion. He's yeah. got excellent technique and combinations. Yeah. And he's yeah. just really, he never like loses his calm, you know what I mean? He's got, he's, there's a reason he's got that belt, yeah. Yeah. But then again, just like the feeling of fighting someone from all around the world. Yeah, you know, it's different. Right now, yeah. It's totally different. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not your average, your local Japanese sparring mate. Oh, it's look at that shot. He hits hard, Suarez. <laughs> nice. Okay, watch out. Yeah, this is still round one. I've got to remind myself. It's like, it's just, wow, there's so much happening in here. That was a really short, short hook. I actually think that might have done more damage than we were actually able to see here on the screen. Good kick. So Suarez gets off the plane from Argentina. A couple of days in Japan. First time in K1 and he's fighting champion. <laughs> oh. Look at that low kick. He keeps like really hitting it. Beautiful. Bam. You can hear the Spanish <laughs> yeah. as the seconds are yelling at him, right? Yeah. It's like, I wonder what they're saying, but it, it's totally exciting, right? Yeah, for them, it's a, it's a, it's a drive. It's a, it's a it's not, well, in a way, it's an interesting. Fantastic career. first round for Suarez. Yeah. Love that. I think we'll see some of that. Man, he got that up. close. Like, that close. It was close, about. right? Yeah. And uh, yeah, I think it threw Gunji off his guard a little, and uh, then but it gave him motivation to sort of uh, flash back this much. Yeah, for it. sure. I mean, Gunji really came back strong. That one there. Whoa! Whoa. You see? Whoa. You see? He nearly he fell over. That close. Gunji nearly did fell over, but not quite. How okay. did he stay on his feet on that one? Yeah. Look at this. See, he almost got it boom, back. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, if, if the post wasn't there, the, yeah, Suarez is almost. Yeah, that was a fantastic first round. Wow, I, I did, yeah, I, it, it happened so far. I didn't know that Gunji was sort of almost a little wobbly for about two or three steps there. Let's see what happens in round two. Wow. All right, if you had to bet money, who would you put it on? Three, two, one, answer. <laughs> Gunji, Gunji got ah, Suarez. Uh, uh, I, I, I love his, I love his Suarez style. What you know? Gunji is the champion, so I mean, it's 
to be expected that he would be the favorite to win mm -hmm. this. But I'm telling you, Suarez is absolutely fantastic. Yeah, and it, it, as you said, it's that sort of international match, if you like. I would like to put my money on Suarez, to be honest. Mm. Yes. Oh, man. Oh, no. Okay, okay, okay. No, no. That was just a... Oh, down there. Great combination. Suarez keeps coming. Like textbook, right mm. there. But from both of them, actually, they're yep. doing really good. Yep. I'm thinking in power-wise that Suarez's low kicks are a little bit stronger. But then, you know, Kunji's combinations are doing really well. Yeah. Look at that. See? Nice. That's what I'm talking about. Beautiful. Oh, what? Man, this fight is so evenly matched. Mmm. Good map. Oh, 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 nice body. Oh, dangerous knee there. Ah, that's gonna hurt. I mean, it's gonna hurt. <laughs> Kinji, Kinji just teaching him about Japanese punching. No, but he's wow. really being like wow. the aggressor here because he feel like, you know, he, he, he probably feels like he lost the first round mm, somehow mm. because of that flash. Jeez. Almost knocked down, just didn't get counted on. Yeah. So he's trying to make up for lost time here somehow. Did and he's really lose. doing well. Whoa. He's really taking control of the fight. That was an accident. No big deal. Didn't do any damage, so they're cool with it. I'm kind of feeling like Gunji's actually controlling the fight a little bit better than Suarez here. Yep. I would like to see Suarez get a little bit more aggressive there and just like, you know, take the pace of the fight into his own hands. But so old oh, Eagle. Oh, that was go. That, he got hurt there. He got hurt. Oh my god. Oh, 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 oh relentless. Suarez doesn't Whoa, want to be in the corner. Nice there. comeback. Yeah. Uh, I think it's he's hurting the fight. Yeah, I mean, he's, he's being, I mean, he got the beating. Really, yeah, but really he, beating. he held on, man. Yeah. He held on. Still there, coming out yeah, of the corner. Yeah, he's still there. Oh, yeah, it oh. hurts. It hurts. Oh, what? It's got to hurt. Man, the condition of these fighters is absolutely mind-blowing. Oh, yeah, you've seen, you've seen a bit of sort of drawing back there by Suarez. He's really just holding on here. How long can you hold on? You got... wanna, like, in this situation, you want to be able to like, some, sneak something in there. Oh, yeah. oh, 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 Five seconds to go in round two. Okay, yeah, okay. Suarez maybe wants to recover a little. What do you think? Fought like a champ. Mm. I tell you, I'm putting my money on Gunji mm. for the last round. Okay. Yeah. Man, because he almost dropped him with the body there. Oh. He was hurt for sure. Like, when... clearly damaged. Yeah. So okay. this is a clear 10.9. You know, 10 mm. to Gunji and then 9 for Suarez in this round. Man, he yes. crushed it. Yeah, Suarez needs to, well, I guess come back in round 3 and, and make a he difference. Just, you know, he, he, he took control of the round and stayed on oh. it. And then he hurt him. Yeah. But Suarez didn't go down. Did, which yeah. Is super impressive. Um, I'm standing. thinking he's going to recover here in the minute mm -hmm. and then come back strong in the third round. Let's hope he brings some goodness from South America and Argentina. Suarez versus Gunji in this third round coming up. Hmm. You know, you walk into round two, this one guy. You know his strong points and weak points, and you're just thinking, what can I do? What yeah. can I do? He has to be busier than Vinji in this round to even get a chance of winning. Mm. Which at least he's starting off good as. Ooh. But here we go. You know, Vinji's yeah. like coming right back into his mode. Because Vinji feels comfortable doing this. Yep. Stephanie has a, a, I think, good impression on the judges so far, I think, so. Oh, hey, hey, big shot, big shot. Oh, he slipped that one. And that one too. 
Haven't slipped up. <laughs> no, yeah. Yeah, so that is just putting more effort in there. Oh, yeah. yeah, nice. That was a sneaky high kick. Really dangerous. Nice block on it, actually. Good jab. Again, he's going for the body. Yeah, you know what he knows where it hurts. And he's also putting pressure on him, getting him up against the ropes again. So, basically, the same strategy in round three from Gunji mm. because it worked in round two. Seems to have the upper hand. Oh, he's looking for openings. I like it. He's very comfortable in there, by the way. So I just not so so. Just, uh, just counter punch it. Yeah, he's kind of fighting off the back foot here, uh, Suarez. Yeah. Because he's got that, that pressure. He's not like taking like control of the fight, mm -hmm. like leading where the fight is going. Totally, this is in Gunji's hands. You know, he's not even yeah, he's not even worried about those punches coming. He'll slip it or counter it or block it. And pay back big time too. Yeah. yeah. In Japanese, we say Kano Ichimai. Right, right, one here, one step. Yeah, one step ahead of him. Yeah. But that doesn't mean he's gonna knock him out or anything. Mm, it's mm. the same. He's just, he's just technically better. Yeah, and it's not experience. I mean, Suarez is, is about eight years older uh, than Gunji, but doesn't. It's, it's about, I guess, just knowing the game, you know, and, and uh, even. They've both got about, you know, 25, 20, yeah. 27 fights. Right, so, yeah, so they've got the experience. Same kind of experience. But just knowing what to do and when. Gunji looks calm here, though. Oh, nice job. Yeah, we're totally running out of time here. No, yeah, and, and Suarez's punches are not reaching. Yeah, at this point, I don't think you're going to see anything like spectacular, but clearly you never know. But, I mean, yeah. Definitely, this is a 30-28 yep. to Gunji, in yep. my opinion. There we have it, round three. So my scorecard is 30 to Gunji and 28 to uh, Suarez. Mm -hmm. So that would be like a draw on the first round and a... Sure. Yeah. Because he, he came out quite spectacularly at the oh, beginning there. Yeah. My life, my rules, is that his tattoo? I didn't quite read that, yeah. yeah. My life, my okay, yeah. Let's see what the judges' rules are. 28. 30 to 28. Oh, oh, that was my yep. scorecard, yes. I agree. Oh, 30 to 27, goes to Gunji. Oh, and 30 to 27 to Gunji in this uh, quarterfinal. And, uh, title Gunji on the K1 featherweight World Tournament. Yeah, I called it as it is. Yep. It's a good fight though. Judge Peterson, yeah, you, you predicted the, 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 the game there and we'll see Gunji go up and fight, I guess, Kumura later on. Yeah, he's going to fight mm. Shuhei Gura. Nice. Great. Great combination. What a, great lead. Yeah. Just great everything. And experience for Sueda Suarez too from his first K1 fight ever and first time ever in Japan. So, My only question is, how badly did he really want to knock it out? Ooh, we'll see what happens. This was the K1 Featherweight World Tournament. Thank you for watching. I'm Russell Goodall. And Nicholas Pettis.